Yo, it's your boy Vandro, Dr. Back again with another video, guys. So I'm here with the S23 Ultra. And this time I'll be showing you a really cool way that you can monitor the battery percentage on each of your Bluetooth devices that you have paired to the phone. So at the moment, I have my Bluetooth earbuds here, my Galaxy Buds. Also, the S Pen is classed as a Bluetooth device, so I can monitor the battery levels on the S Pen. And also, if you have a watch as well, like a Samsung Galaxy Watch 4 or 5, yeah, I think it's you have to use one of the newer, newer Galaxy watches for this to work. The old ones don't work, like the Galaxy Watch Active and the Active 2. So you need a more up-to-date Galaxy Watch and um, it'll show up on the battery indicator. Okay, so I'm going to show you how to do this. So just long press anywhere on the home screen. Select widgets. And then select battery. And in here you will see two battery widgets. So there's two different formats. There's the circular format, and then there's the list format. So let's have a look at the circular format to begin with. Okay, so the S Pen was blank a few seconds ago. I had to actually take it out. So for it to show up for your... Um, Bluetooth devices to show up, they have to actually be in use. So as you can see, my case is opened on the earbuds, but once I close the case, it will disappear from the list. So I've got my S Pen there, the Galaxy Buds case, my Galaxy Buds earbuds, and my phone. So it's showing the phone battery level, 82%, 100% for the Galaxy Buds. And the charging case is at 95% and my S Pen is at 100%. Also, you can adjust it and you can um, add up to another four Bluetooth devices. So in total, that would be eight Bluetooth devices. So I'm just going to remove this off the screen and then we'll take a look at my favorite one which is the list so with this you get a better view you actually can see the name of the connected devices so my s23 ultra galaxy buds pro galaxy buds pro case and the s pen and we can see the battery levels there for each one and once again, you can extend it. And if you long press on it, you can create a card stack and add more widgets. Or you can remove it, or you can go into the settings and customize it. So here you can select which devices to show. So you can turn some off and turn some on. You can select to reorder. So you can set the order of devices shown on the widget. And also here you can change the color. So if you don't want it to be white, you can change it to black and you can change the transparency as well so you can make it fully transparent or you can keep it set to match with the dark mode and whatever changes you make when you're finished and you're satisfied with it just hit save okay so like i says um for your bluetooth devices devices to show up on the widget, you have to be using them. They have to be in use. So the S Pen is out. 
Once you pop it back in, it will disappear off the list. As you can see, the case is open for the earbuds. Once I close the case, as you can see, they're no longer showing up there on the widget until I open the case again. It'll pop right back up. So anyway, guys, that's it for the video. I hope it helped you out. And like I said, if you have a smartwatch as well, you can add the smartwatch to it. It just helps, guys. So you don't have to be looking on your wrist to see how much battery you've got left. You can just check it all from the phone. You don't have to be wondering how much battery you have left on the earbuds. You can just check it all from the phone. Just check the widget. Anyway, guys, that's it for the video. Be sure to give the video a thumbs up. Share the video. It's your boy, the Android Doctor. I'll see you in the next one, guys. I'm out. Deuces.